I just found something good. <laughs> Look, I don't want to get too excited, but I'm thinking penguin. <laughs> It's a beautiful autumn day here in New Zealand, 22 degrees, no wind, and it's low tide, so I'm going to see if we can find some fossils down here today. The sand level is a little bit high, but there are some rocks exposed, so let's see what we can find down here. It's Miocene, I think it's late Miocene, around about the 8 million years old. Let's see if there's some crabs around. Maybe some whale bones. Never really know what you're gonna find down here. I've only walked about 10 meters and I think I found my first fossil. Let's have a look down there. I think I see, yeah, it looks like a piece of claw sticking out there. So I'm gonna assume it's a crab. Have a look, see if you can see it on screen there. It's kind of hiding behind this rock here. See, there's a claw. It's quite an orange claw. Yeah, that looks like a claw, maybe a leg. Another leg over there. Yeah, I'm gonna guess that's some kind of crab in there. Hmm, not sure on the species. Yeah, that's good. Our first find. Let's get it packed away. We can carry on. Oh, I see a, I see another fossil. There's another fossil over there. It looks to be a shell. Yeah, some shells in that rock. I'm going to leave that one behind. I'll take the crab. I think it's going to be quite a good day for crabs. I think I see another one back here. This one was very lucky. I just spotted it as I look back. You can see there's something sticking at the bottom of that rock there, just in the middle there. And I'm thinking it's a crab or a crayfish, or maybe something better. Let's have a look. Hmm. What is that? It actually looks a little bit more fishy, I would say, than crabby. Hmm. Gonna have to take that back and have a look at it. Yeah, that's good. Might have to play around with it at home, maybe put in acid for a while. It's been about an hour since I found that last fossil. I finally found something again. <laughs> I've already picked it up. You can see there's a, a lobster tail sticking out over there. And then some of the, some other bits sticking out there. Let me just zoom in. There's a few bits sticking out there. But what I noticed was the tail part there. That's definitely a lobster tail. One of those difficult ones to prep, but it's a good find. At least I know there's fossils out here. I still haven't found anything uh, vertebrate. It's only been crabs and crayfish so far. I just found something good. <laughs> Look, I don't want to get too excited, but I'm thinking penguin. <laughs> <laughs> I really hope I'm not going to lift up this rock and be really disappointed, but I haven't looked at it properly yet. <laughs> I saw it and I went, whoa. I got the camera out, so let's have a look together. 
This was such a lucky find. I just barely, barely saw something on this rock. Have a look there, there's bones sticking out there at the side of the rock. Smallish bones. We're not talking dolphin or whale, we're talking something small. The only thing I can think of in this area could be fish, could be bird, could be penguin, could be seal. So whatever it is, it's going to be pretty exciting and it's not looking fishy. <laughs> Let's go lift that up together. I haven't moved it yet. <laughs> I'm too nervous. <laughs> Tiny bones, those are tiny bones, that looks like a vertebra. Oh, there's some more. Oh, there's some more there. There's a lot of bones in here. Look at that. Look at the size of that. There's more bones on the other side, look there. There's some sticking out over here and here, over here. <laughs> oh, I'm feeling excited. I'm really hoping this is a penguin or a bird or a seal. I don't think it's a bird. The, the bones don't look too hollow enough. Not a flying bird at least. I'm so excited about that. Look at this bone over here too. This is bones throughout it. Oh, I'm stoked. I don't want to get too excited, but that's looking good for a penguin. We might have found that penguin. <laughs> I'm so excited. Whatever it is, it's good. There's a whole bunch of bones in there. Uh, so we're going to have a pretty complete animal, I think. But I'm so stoked. <laughs> The sun's set and I'm back at the car, so let's get home and check that fossil out. I'm really keen to figure it out. And here are today's finds. Let's take a look at these three small ones first and then have a look at this big boy. This is the first one I found and you can see it definitely has what looks to be a, a crab claw sticking out on that side and a leg over there. Something over there as well. It's got quite a weird color. I haven't seen an orange crab before so it'll be worth prepping one day I think just to see uh, if we can figure out what kind of crab it is. I thought this could be fish, but no, I'm not so sure. It almost looks a little bit carbony. Maybe even a coprolite. Could be some plant material, but I'm not sure on this one. Yeah, if you've got an idea, let me know in the comments. He has that really cool crayfish. It should be pretty complete. Uh, this is the tail, and then if you go around where did I see the other parts I think there are some more parts sticking out there so those could be it's two really narrow claws sticking out to the front so it's kind of curved over something like that and then this incredible find I sent a few photos off to some um, penguin experts and Two, both of them came back actually and said, yeah, that looks like a penguin. <laughs> so for now, I'm going gonna, gonna to call this a penguin. You can see all these bits of bones sticking out. If I had to guess, and I'm not 100% sure, I would say this is the head area. So maybe that's um, the spine. 
and what's quite exciting is this one this piece down here could definitely be part of the skull this section over here that could be part of the skull but it's just packed full of bones I think we're gonna get some really good bones in here there's some more sticking out of on that side some more there <laughs> this big one and then what I think is more towards the bottom so the the legs and maybe even the toes these tiny little things over here yeah that's so exciting <laughs> can't wait to prep this one honestly I haven't stopped smiling since I found this penguin I'm so stoked with it. <laughs> Just thanks again to all the Patreons for your support. Uh, without the Patreons and everyone that's been uh, giving comments and such great feedback on the videos, this wouldn't have been possible. So just thanks everyone. <laughs> this has been such a dream find. Oh, can't wait to prep it and I'll take you all along on the journey for that. Stay safe and I'll see you all in the next hunt.